spill one sec. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be really, really crucial this one. Getting that third Roshan. And as their Scourge and the Sentinel don't have wards out, it's gonna be completely safe. Gonna get that one quickly. We'll see who gets what. As Aegis on the Morphling would be a wise choice. Who gets the cheese? Silencer, of course. Who else? Scotty and, on Morph, well, though. This is ridiculously <laughs> tough suddenly for the Sentinel. They had an even shot at it, but now it's just hard. How has this got to this point? Um, like, Witch Doctor, pipe on, pipe on him. I didn't complete it for that one, but the Sentinel side, just... You know, how has it actually, like, digressed to this point? We're 15 minutes into this one, we're about to, well, this is late game, we're about to hit epic late game, which for me is always over an hour. Um, but like, how is, how is SA not still carving up this entire game? He's still got enough money for a straight buyback, 2800 gold inside his bank account right now. Um, but the Sentinel team are sticking together. I think while they, while they rotated, up, up top, rotated up top before, was they were literally just looking for an opening. They wanted one hero to find farming up and to try and bring him down. And now the Scourge might think about making their own opening straight down the middle of the Sentinel line. And uh, no, there's only four heroes in that middle lane right now. Where is our fifth? Um, Warlock must still be back up. No, there he is. Zeus is now coming out. Hello, there he is. Gem of True Sight actually up on Zeus right now. No way for SA to actually get a lucky, lucky initiate off here. They... This, this is so hard. This is just so hard. Like, Sentinel surprises with the SA pick and surprises with just how ferocious they've been throughout this entire game. I'm wondering right now if they can surprise us with a win as well. Because at the moment, all cars have just turned to GG net again. Definitely not looking good. And, uh, yeah, that, that, um, that Morphling with the Aegis, with the 4,000 gold he's got as well. Aegis 4,000 gold, Skadi. He's got pretty much full inventory. When that Aegis is used, he can fill up that last slot, perhaps with a Satanic or whatever he feels like. It's going to be beef. Oh, yeah, we'll see what he gets. That, there will be three orb Oh, no, two orb effects in the Skadi. That's all right. Um, but, yeah, we'll... It's... Um, it's Right now, it's a matter of who gets the good initiation, as it has been the last three fights. Um, but what we haven't seen so far, we haven't seen uh, the GGNet team pushing in an even battle. The push they got was because they were really far ahead. And uh, what we could see now is if they make this push too brutal, then uh, if the Sentinel gets the good jump and wins that fight, then they're going to push them back just as hard and win the game. So, uh, yeah. What has taken this game so far right now is the experience of the Scourge team. They've been better in the pressured situation right here. They've been able to fight against ridiculous odds by just using their experience, their positioning and their individual hero play better than the Sentinel. And uh, we've got a disconnect, okay? I'm very, very but, glad um, we actually saved the game about a minute ago. <laughs> yeah, there's just a little bit of lag coming through here. Um, probably so I don't think this bot's actually quite good. Um, but yeah, basically, save game. I reckon we're going to see a bit of a, uh, we will see a reload. They can't finish this game right now where we are. Like, or can they? So we're just going to double check with our ref. Luckily, this is why we have the refs inside the game. So are people now leaving the game voluntarily? Uh, this is coming out from the uh, Sentinel side. Nincompoop just deciding. So, uh, Sindrin, it is a, um, a bit of an uh, interesting position we currently sit ourselves in. More than likely, we'll have a straight reload and we'll, and we'll come from here. And I think the host is about to actually um, cark it for a second, spike, and then all of a sudden just uh, choke on it. Um, but as far as the Sentinel side go, like, you look at the lineup, Kurakai is strong. Like, that Morphling is beyond all strong right now. Is there a way to bring him down? Is there a way the Sentinel can actually win the next fight and get some sort of momentum back into this game? Because at the moment, it feels like it's sliding down the hill in favor of GG Net, but it's also very, very open towards the Sentinel side if they can win a good initiation. I'm, guess I'm guessing we kind of half lost him. 
You see, tell me you're still with us, dude. Nope, no, we actually got a little bit of problems with this as well, and uh, wow, I think even I've actually managed to be dropped from it. Guys on the stream, can you actually still see it as well? Are we still running live is the question for you all. Can't handle the epicness of the game. That's why we have VODs though. And uh, Nick and Poop actually does drop from the game. And uh, there we go as well. So um, we'll see a rehost back up again. We'll, um, we'll call Cinderin once more. And uh, restart the stream back up again because everyone on the VODs, um, welcome. This happens sometimes. Net going gaga and all. Hopefully we should be okay for, okay for the rest of the night. And uh, yeah, we go. Okay, we should be back up and live again. Hopefully everyone out there is okay and um, not too worried. Actually had a massive spike come through everybody just then. So, uh, phew. Not quite sure why what went wrong. Why must you lag? I don't know why I must lag. More worry about the um, about the game. I'm hoping that this is not the end of the game, <laughs> and they're not playing it out with four v four. Possible you might reload it on the host spot as well. Um, I'm just gonna put a banner up for just a moment, um, just so you don't see me going, oh, I wonder what we're doing. Um, so here you go. All right, so we have actually just been told that every single player got DC'd, <laughs> as in the bot and team ends. <laughs> All right, so we might just have a... Um a moment here. I'm actually going to stop, uh, for, the, for the people who are actually going to be on the VOD, um, I'm going to stop the VOD right now. Of course, we will be back with another segment. Likely we put it all into parts on, uh, on CG. So uh, don't you fear, there will be another part for you. Um, so look, look for part two or three or four. Maybe actually with this one, you'll be looking at part seven for the amount of time this game has actually gone. So uh, we'll be back in just a moment with your next part of the VOD. <laughs> 